So you have noticed that if you let your pump run for 24 hours, you will lose more water than if you go through 24 hours where the pump is turned off. What that's an indication of is that you have a leak somewhere in your plumbing system. Um, what the, how you come to that conclusion is basically when you pressurize the system, let's say you have a leak in your return line. So somewhere in the pipe leading from your equipment pad back to the pool, let's say there's a crack or a break in that line somewhere. Well, when it's just sitting uh, stationary and static, there's no pressure being pushed through that line, then it will probably have a slower rate of water loss than when you turn on the pump and there's 20 PSI uh, charging that line, forcing the water to escape from any uh, deficiencies like a crack or a separation in a fitting uh, or leak around a clamp, anything like that. So that would be a normal indication is that if you, uh, if you run your pump for 24 hours and you notice that you lose a lot more water than when you turn the pump off, um, that's an indication it's not in the structure of the pool. If it was in the structure of the pool, you'd, you'd lose the same amount of water whether the pump was on or off. But in your situation, we've identified that the um, there's probably a deficiency somewhere in the plumbing system. And so we're going to have to take another step and to determine exactly where in the plumbing system the problem could be. Um, that's usually going to involve a pressure test. Uh, pressure test is not something that every pool owner can do themselves, um, but it is something that you could explore doing or you could contract somebody. If you've, re if you've reached this point in your process of elimination and you realize that, you know, I'm pretty sure I need a, a pressure test, then you can probably find a leak detection company local to you that will perform the pressure test for you if it's not something you're comfortable doing, or you can do some more YouTubing and watch more videos on how to pressure test your pool. And that's more than likely going to uh, reveal the location of the leak if that's the, experience, if that's the situation that you're experiencing with your pool.